Hi guys, welcome to another sketch here tutorial. So today we're going to talk about how to encode and decode images. So let's start. So uh, this simple project which I was made, and this is the project app. So in this you can encode um, an image and decode it back. So what is the advantage of this? So what is the best thing is you don't need to store the image. On if you are using a cloud or if you are using the Firebase, if you are using any kind of database, you don't need to store the image the sto into the storage. So what happen is just convert into text and you can save the text in the database and you can get it back and you can uh, view as the image as the original one. So let's start how it works. So you can see you just need to click this image. This is a simple project. So I will select an image uh, that I want to convert. So I will select this image. So I want to convert this image to a text. So how do I do that is you have to click encode and it will be encoded. You can see here it's encoded. It's everything encoded. So how can I get it back is click this one decode and it's decoded back. So now I'm going to show you uh, how to go to this project and how you can use this one. And I will explain how are the implementation of the codings. So this project uh, you can get it from click sorry you can get it from Sketchit which is a Sketcher store. So you can go to uh, the Play Store and get it or else you can search on Play Store and get it. So I have already searched so this is one Sketchit Sketcher store. So open it. Okay I just open it. Let me wait some time. Oh, it's loading okay so so this is the latest project that I has implored, uh, imported so if you can't find it you can search as in code you if you uh, search as e uh, n c o d then it's coming so this is the project so let's waste seconds okay so this is the project so you can see uh, it says encode and decode images, save images into string and save in a database. So let's download the project. Okay. Okay, it's downloading. Okay, replacing file and it's done. So it's done. It's downloaded. So let's go to the sketch here. Okay, refresh. Okay, this is a project. Okay, let's open it. Okay, this is the source code. So um, I have created two blocks, actually three one for radius of the linears and two blocks for encode and decode. So let's go, go to the encode codings. So these are the encode codings. You can see the it's used um, for encoding and this encodings, this string this uh, image is converted to a text and saved into string called image string this one so you can get it back with this variable so if you replace this variable to another variable you can get the text so what i'm do is when i click it uh, it's uh, replacing edit text to the particular variable get the uh, value of the particular variable which is image string so how it works is you just when i click encode it should do it should um, convert the image view one image to a string and save it to this edit text so which is this one is the image one and then after decode is you have to decode that particular image which is the string or you can get the edit text value also um, this one to the particular image which is which is image two so what i'm doing converted that text Make sure that text is a valid text converting that text to the another image which is this one so i will so this is the totally source code so there are only two commands intent and file pick um, you can pick the file so it's i will show you again how it works i will show you again how it works okay let me close it and open it again okay uh, now let's click open the let's select an image so i will select um, this image so i want to encode so it's encoded you can see here the text is encoded and i want to decode it back okay done so this is how it works so this is how we encode images and decode it back so hope you like this video 
and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you subscribe thank you